Remember the racetrack? I remember the racetrack. This is the fucking racetrack. This area of the game is now death. And there's also an orb over there. Hey, 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 wrong button. Uh, I don't know how we're gonna get over there. Unless if I use a little bit of cheating. I don't know how else you would get over here. But I'm doing this way. And we're here. Unless if we just go around. That's probably what you had to do originally. But oh my god. That is, that is some good shit. That is a lot of good shit. Alright, let's revert. Let's go over here. Kick these boxes. Get more shit. God damn, game. Oh no, we... Alright, well... I don't know how else you would get over here. Like, holy shit. Unless... Oh, I, I see how you would get over here. First, let's do this. You would fly over here. You go in this crevice. And then... You would... Uh, I, I don't trust it. But... Uh, you could probably... No. No. Whatever. We made it. Let's revert back again. Let's shoot these off. Ay, 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 oh, okay. They gave me a tutorial. Uh, fuck you, game. You think I'm so dumb that I can't remember that? I can't remember things? Because I'm pretty sure I can remember things. God, there is things all over the place. I don't need any more metalheads. I didn't even need metalheads in the first place. Okay, uh, where's the thing we have to break? Because I know it gave me the whole, we got break shit. Way before we were supposed to even be there. Uh, boom, I missed. That one, God, holy dicks, man. There we go. Let's recharge. Just in case I need it. That's bouncing. Oh my god, see? J Jack 2, the, like the world's all fucked up. Uh, god, it's a little uneasy. Like, when you, I love it when games, like, when there's a post-apocalyptic version of that game, you see game, like, you see areas where, oh, I know that area, it was from a different game, and that game is, I play that game, now I play this. Just revisiting of areas in, like, future games is just, it's just cool. Don't know why. And then when the area has changed because of an event, and you're like, oh, I remember when this place wasn't fucked up, or it was different. I had, I had that same feeling with Jack 2 when you went to see the hut. Like, holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Uh. Wrong button. Normally, we would grind. So, let's grind. Because, fuck glitches. Play it legit. Alright, we gotta do it again. Alright, so you grind on these rails that are conveniently placed. So, where you can go to the other side. Uh, you grab some light. Actually, no, you don't, apparently. There we go. We were already full, so it didn't, like, magnetize to us like it normally would. Uh, shoot this. Get more ammo, because ammo is always a good thing to have. Jump over here. Barely make it. Come over here. Shoot this nest, because you don't need that. No one needs it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it from all the way back here so they don't give us a tutorial. Because it's already open. Yeah. Did it. We did it, guys. I am thinking, nope. I would have put something there, and I they did not. But I think they knew that I would think that. So that's why they didn't. Oh. See? Logic of developers. Uh, I can't go over there. But I can't go over here because we have to go over here. Jump, 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 jump. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, wow. No time was given for them to be living because they were already dead. They, The second they saw me, oh, God. Yeah, the second they see Jack is the second they die. See, oh. Oh, wow. Some of them had a couple seconds. Impressive. 
That's just because they were behind one of their friends. Using them as a meat shield. Because I'm assuming they're made out of meat. Because... I don't know. I just assume. They might, they might not even be meat. It might be just a weird muscle texture thing that's not meat. I don't know. Fuck it. Let's break shit. Let's do it from all the way back here so they can give us a tutorial. Did it. I'm gonna hoverboard over here. Because I just did. Where have you been? I've molded three times already just waiting for you. Onan says we must get through the palace ruins, but I think... Uh-oh. Jack, let me just say, before it's all over, riding on your shoulder, although it is kind of bony and uncomfortable, well, you've been a good pal. You too, Dax. These adventures, they've been great. Someone called for an army. But you're a long way from the desert. I thought you said a smart warrior never takes his opponent head on. That depends on how hard your skull is. I'd say you and I are both rather headstrong. Let's finish this. Let's. We are using an intense vehicle for intense people. Uh, this is kind of a actually a hard part. Even though you have a insanely awesome vehicle that will destroy anything in its path, with both of its guns and its everything else. Um. It just gets hard, and they send a lot of enemies for you, but this is pretty much a pretty good definition of a final area. It's epic. Everybody's coming together to, you know, well, not everybody, but, like, just shit gets real, and then, you know, using multiple elements from the rest of the game and, and applying them to this one set area it's just this is great just epic adventure ending awesomeness of awesome and just fucking shit up and there's more to come in your face oh shit all right go 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 all right run him over there we go back up motherfucker there we go so these guys think that, wow words, those guys think that we're going to go down. Oh, that's a thing. So yeah, if you haven't noticed, stay clear of the uh, red targets that are on the ground. Because uh, that means shit's going to be thrown at you at a very explosive velocity. And um, you might indeed uh, not like it. Because uh, damage and or death can be involved in said situation. And uh, a lot of the parts of this uh, area, you have to use your boost to break shit. Your gun won't be enough. Like, so those broken walls uh, would be boost. This would be boost. Because you gotta destroy those things in order to go to the next area. Since those electrical walls are in the way, uh, we could run over these guys with little to no damage to us actually no damage to us and uh, destroy that uh, there's another one around here to destroy I know it it's right there the only reason why I know that is because the thing did it unlock you thought you were gonna use that shield to protect yourself but you weren't because you got fucked Wow I ran right into that I should have boosted but I I, I didn't Anyway, jump. Yeah. Oh, well, fuck. Fuck that jump. Dodge that one like a boss. Um, these are... It's a little bit harder to drive than it looks through here. Because it's pretty, pretty fucking rocky. Not like Rocky Balboa. It's more like Rocky IV. It's just hard to go, it's just hard to go through. And it's just one bumpy ride. Uh, do we, should we go over here? Nope, let's not go over there. We're going to be doing some jumping in this area. This area is, uh, in the past what fucked me before I really figured out how to do it well. Uh, da, 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 oh, so much speed. But yeah, for pretty much, you got boost and jump. 
and then pass those segments. Um, I don't think that is, this is the last one. No, because there's one more. I know it. So let's go over. Let's go back over here. Let's jump. Fuck, that was not a jump. This part's also a bitch because when that happens, you can't really do much. Whoa, what the fuck is this area? Oh! There's shit over here. I never knew that. I never thought this would be. This is how you get here. I just jumped it. Huh. Good to know, I guess. Anyway, uh, so that's how you get up there the easy way. Or you could just try to jump it over there, which I've done. Which I've had to do, because I did not know that area existed. But now you guys know that area existed. So, uh, you guys can do that. And cutscene. together don't move out please promise me one thing promise me you'll find my son mar you'll know him when you see this he's wearing an amulet just like it a symbol of our lineage with the great house of mar <coughs> save the people jack they need you Father. Yes, you were that child. I took you from Deimos, hoping to harness your eco powers for my experiments. Then I lost you to the underground. You seem upset. Did I tell you too late? You were the son of the great warrior Deimos. Oh, and he never knew. How delightful. Ah! Bigger! Thank you for opening the door to the Precursors. Don't worry, I'll be back to put you out of your misery. After him, Jack! You're willing to go down there? Without a fuss this time. Yeah, well, don't get used to it. It's just that nobody hurts my best friend and lives to brag about it. Let's get him! Shitty ass Vigor. Dick. Freaking epic though. Freaking Dexter standing up for uh Jack. And yo, let's go down and fuck his shit up. That's pretty much what happened. I love it. So we're back at this uh section again. Um Same thing as last time. Uh do a lot of shooting, don't go in the holes. Um I'm not, there, there's no way to slow down or anything. Uh, oh, I thought I just found a way to do it, but no, there's not. Um, yeah, make sure you don't hit those pillars and don't, just don't run out of health. And again, a lot of shooting helps, because, uh, you don't, because, god fucking A. A lot of shooting helps, because then you can shoot the pillars out of your way, so then you don't get hit by the pillars. Even though a lot of explosions happen, uh, just try to look past the explosions and not die. Fucking A. That's the words I was trying to find. God. Damn. Alright, and now this area. That was not too bad. Let's watch a cutscene, because I know it's going to happen right about now. defense system. The Ecos 
step aside! I will be the one who evolves into a fracasa! The right is mine! Be careful what you wish for. It is done. Don't worry, Jack. It is for the greater good that I assume this role. Even now, it may be too late. If Aaron awakens the dark ship's cargo, all will be lost. Listen, Glowboy. We've been doing all your dirty work while you slept in the stars. So stop it! Inefficient. I told you we needed a backup hero. We should have gone with plan B. Ow! Hey, cut it out! We are unhappy with your performance. If you had been a true hero, you would have stopped Errol by now. Oh my god. Yes, well, uh, now we are even more angry, and uh, we order you to avert your eyes, or we will learn. Oh, Baba. They look like me? Not what you expected. Yeah, we like get that a lot. Don't look so upset. If you knew we precursors were a bunch of little fuzzy rats, would you worship us? Could we run the universe? Not possible, buddy. So, we fluff up the myth? A bit. Then we get the respect we deserve. You idiots! Get down from there and stop defiling that glorious machine! Do not let our size fool you. We are the most powerful beings in the universe. We are? Why does Daxter look like? Ah, yes. All eco contains the source of our essence. Our code, so to speak. When Daxter touched the dark eco, he was actually blessed when he thought he was cursed. Woohoo! I'm a precursor! I'm a precursor! I'm a precursor! Hey! Wait a minute! They have pants! These creatures are the great precursors? I wanted to evolve into the... No! A little drafty, isn't it? The only way to ensure that Errol will not awaken the ship's cargo is to go there yourself and stop him. We will send you there from here. But the weapon... Chill out, buddy. You should have Mondale minutes to go there and get back here pronto. I'm way before the... Hopefully before. Ba-boom! Oh, yeah! Let's move. You idiots. I told you we needed a plan B. Uh, so the precursors are Otzels. Just keep that in your mind. How interesting that is. By the way, I like I told you, this is not the, that one time was not the last time we're going to see this area. We're also going to see this area as a jack. So let's do some platforming. Boom. 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 Fuck you. Boom. 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 Shit, shit. Ah, oh, you dickhead. Alright, one more time. Woo! Let's just kill everything in the room intensely. That was fast. That took literally f six seconds because I can. Alright, I'm going to wait for the first one to come back around. Boom, 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 boom. Ah, jump, jump. Why are don't you jump when you're... F Damn it. And we made it. Alright, cool. Uh, I'm going to switch to this weapon. Because I can. Uh, I'm not going to try to kill everybody in that room because I don't have to. Let's slide like a boss, though. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, we are back here. Uh, I failed at that one part a couple times again. Just saying. Um, Alright, you know, I'm just going to nuke this whole room. So, uh, bye. Alright, get fucked. Ah, okay. So there's these retracting poles. They retract and attract, I guess. Oh, God, I was not expecting that one to happen. That guy died. That guy died. Oh, well. Uh, bye. 
Okay, let's go through here. How do I go through here? Do I have to kill everything? I did have to kill everything. Wow, shitty. What if you didn't have ammo for your any of your guns? Hey, what's up? Wow. That was quick and easy. Like her mom. Oh! Wow, that took a while for me to uh, become Birdman. Birdman! So let's fly over here. Because I can. Boom, boom, boom. I can do this. Don't worry. I got this. They're just flying. Good thing we're not getting shot at. That would be shitty. But we got this. We're over the platforms and over the mountains and and then over death. Oh, uh, they they think they got something on me. That's cute. <laughs> now they're dead. All right. So oh, more things to kill us. Cool. Cause that's what I want for my birthday. That was five months ago. Fuck you or six. I, I don't count. Well, whenever March was. All right. Um. Damn it. I die. There we go. Boom. 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 Uh. I don't have a lot of ammo at all. Actually, I have almost no ammo. Please die. Now I have literally no ammo. Now I have one piece of ammo. Ammunition. Ammunition. Like in, uh... Grand Theft Auto. That's the words. That's the title of that one game I play a lot. Um... We're just going down the elevator. A very huge elevator. A very epic looking elevator. And now we are in a area... That's going to have a cutscene. These nasty things ever wake up. The planet's finished. All of these dark makers at my command. Just think what I could do. You're through, Arrow. Even if we both die. Ah! Oh. Let's go, Dax. Let's go, Dax. Alright, this is epic of, as shit. We are going through this area of of a ship getting destroyed. And we're on falling platforms. And also, plat the same ass platform getting lifted up and hitting us. Just insane. We we just got we to gotta get the fuck out, man. We gotta get the fuck out. Oh god, we almost died. But we still gotta get the fuck out. Even though we almost died. But And you also you know which parts that are land and which parts aren't by the uh, texture and here is a cutscene God, it's so heartwarming, man. So epic. I love it. Again, Dragon Dax, your favorite series. One of them. Like, top five. Probably top three, actually. It's probably number two. Actually, to be honest. They need to make more. They definitely need to make more. Like, Jack 4. 
Come on, Naughty Dog, you could do it. And have uh, Jack and Final Frontier not count, because that game was just no. You, you, you could leave off from Jack X, that was actually entertaining. And it had something to do with something. And all the characters actually looked like their character and sounded like their character. Get the same voice actors back to you, that'd be great. Uh, alright, so, uh, for this, uh, this is the final boss, this first segment, uh, there are, uh, these purple things on his, uh, legs, on his feet that you have to blow up, uh, to shoot, there is, uh, red dots on the map to know where they're at, um, and, uh, a lot of them are easy, and then, like, a good ten of them, not ten, a good five of them are not, cause they're on the other side, you know, where he's not walking. Or where, like, towards where he's walking, so you have to get in front of him first. And also he's throwing a bunch of shit at you. Ow. Okay, I, ha I have never been hit that much in a row in this boss fight. So, uh, this is gonna be looking good. Looking good. Alright, um. Also, it kinda sucks when he gets over to water areas. But yeah, it's freaking... He's walking all throughout the desert destroying shit showing how massive he is and showing how massive the world is which is great epic fight on the desert again it's great um god damn it also there's enemies um lack of patrol ah I was so close on that one I just like to hold down the fire button because again you don't have overheat, you don't have ammo to worry about. But you have you do have a lot of those freaking prick ass prick face fucking prick bombs. Literally they have pricks on them. Like I'm not lying here. I am not the Lion King either. Holy cunt buckets. Alright, there's too much of these. Too much. So let's speed up. Ah, oh, you foot fuck. He is going through a town. Let's just go around. Actually, oh yeah, that was sweet. That was sweet. Uh, let's go over here. Oh wow, that he took a big leap. Oh no 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 no! Oh, last second, freaking sweeped it out of his leg. Literally, just right from his foot. Just poof, explosions and shit. He is going that way, the way that I am not... Okay, control. Alt, delete. Um, okay, so that one's behind his foot, which is good. So it's, that one's going to be easy. I don't think the next one is, though. So, the, the yep, right there. That last one's going to be a little hard. I might be able to get it this turn, though. Nope. Oh, yeah, damn it, yeah, who? The conveniency of it landing right outside the city. 
All right, they give us a good portion of our ammo back, which is great. Uh, I'm going to use uh, the ones I normally don't use while scaling this thing. There's not too much uh, to scaling this, but then, you know, this is just leading up to the final boss fight, which is pretty intense. But once you... I wish there was a slightly different ending to it. You know, compared to how it does end, like the final blow, but I, I'll tell you that once it happens. Okay, uh, this whole battle, like this is the battle now. We're, like we're here, no cutscene leading to it. It's just is. Um, the uh, the purple gun is very good for destroying the tech uh, tentacles, like very good for it. Um. And also, let's uh, use some of our light power to uh, heal ourselves, because we can do that. And there's going to be a lot of that going on in this boss fight, because again, it's pretty intense. Not going to lie. And if you haven't... Okay, the final blow is going to be with a gun. I'm not going to say what gun, but it's obviously going to be with a gun. I'm not spoiling anything there. I wish that the final blow was using either dark or light eco, making it a little bit more epic, because, you know... It just is. Using, like, the power that no one else can use. And being awesome. And, you know, just 100% power. You know. Like like the ending of J the original Jack and Daxter. Like, that would be amazing. Now, they're giving us time to uh, refill our ammo. And uh, not ammo. Our powers. So then you could go ahead and... Uh, you know, heal yourself or kill everything in sight. All that good stuff. Uh, doing the technique that I usually do throughout this whole, you know, game also works with those tentacle creatures. And also work with those. It works with everything. You know what? Just say that. It works with everything. Uh, normally, uh, it'd be easier to shoot uh, him when he's doing that whole laser thing. You have to shoot him in the back of the head to uh, damage him. Right? It's easier to use the uh, purple gun, the uh, powerful gun, and because um, it's like auto aim and everything, kind of. But you could also just do this, which is not as accurate, but it's still a thing. All right, and I believe he's gonna start using it, like the left and right. Nope, still not yet. See, like just like in every boss fight, final boss fight. Uh, the stages get harder and harder even though the stages are re repetitious like it's, it's a formula that it follows it still is uh uh gets harder throughout the you know throughout the fight like every every time he gets hit he gets more powerful it seems like so now he's using that jump over the laser and fire at will he gets hurt i'm switching back to this gun and I'm gonna do ah shit. I didn't I don't have enough of that. Never mind. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. I'm gonna use my blue gun because that is homing everywhere. There we go. That just happened. Whoa. That was weird. We just had Can I shoot him can I shoot him? I just realized that. Like can I shoot from behind? Like it, it's going at him. Okay, I guess not. Um, I just, I just waste all my blue ammo, but the, this fight does give you plenty of ammo, so you never run out. Everything you kill gives you ammo. So it's like equivalent exchange plus some. So they will always give you ammo, which is good. I like it when, you know, they, the boss fight doesn't force you to, you know, get fucked on your resources. Using my light power, pretty much you will, if you, if you don't do too bad, you won't die. You know, as long as you uh, grab the uh, energy and everything from the transition areas where you actually hit them. Uh, so, always abuse that time for that. And when he's using that laser, always move and move back towards the uh, back. or f Yeah, no, that's technically the back. And then once he's done using it, move to the front so then you have room to move back. I like to do this, go here, boom, one last hit, 
Oh, he's using his head. And he's do he does it multiple times this round. There we go. I think he does it one more time. Nope. Alright, just because I can to get rid of these guys. Boom. Just because it's epic and it's the final boss fight, I like to use all my resources. Ah, I just wasted that. Alright. Ah, well, you're also a douche. So, uh, I'm going to heal for a little bit. I just healed. He's using the laser while I was healing, but, you know, it didn't damage me, which is great. Uh, I'm going to use this because I can. Oh, ah, wow, well, I got hit. Uh, let's go over here, do a little bit of this, do a little bit of that. Okay. That is nice of you to uh, be a dick. Grenade. Wow. Freaking no chances with the grenade there. Ha 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 ha, you're a dick. Alright, he's gonna use his head again. So, when you, when he telegraphs his attack, just move and then press square where you get really far. Like right before he hits, square. And then, final blow. Let's do this. You brave people of this planet, Onan, Samos, and all. Your strength and wisdom in these dark times give us reason to fight on. My life's work, it turns out, was spent searching for a bunch of furballs. Onan says it is a great day for the universe. Jack, you are the greatest of heroes. You have turned the tide against the Dark Makers, and together we will win this war. But, dude, there are, like, way more challenges in the future. Ha! <laughs> uh, or was it the past? Yes, yes, I was getting to that. More adventures? Where have I heard that before? We need heroes like you to help us protect the universe, Jack. Then you can call me by my first name. By what my father called me. Mar. Wait, Jack is Mar? The Mar? Come then, Ma. No time like the present. You coming, Dax? I got all I need right here, baby. But if you need me, and I know you will, eh, you know where to find me. Oh, Daxter, my little hero. We owe you much, Daxter, for all you've done. For your bravery in the face of incredible danger, we shall grant you your deepest desire. You know, I can really use a snazzy pair of pants, like yours. Wow, those are sharp. I wish I had a pair just like that. Be careful what you wish for. Don't worry, honey. You get used to it. Oh, and you may want to shave some parts. Trust me on that. Hey! Thanks for everything, partner. You are a great hero, Daxter. This is gonna be good. They think I'm a god. And they're right! Our hero! <sighs> This is going to be a long trip. Where do you think you're going, little bugger? I've decided I want my own sidekick, and you've been nominated. We're gonna be a great team. Just don't make me angry. Are you ready, Jack? We have something to show you. What? The universe.
I couldn't leave you, Dax. With all our adventures ahead, you wouldn't last a second without me. Ah, what a team we are! Yeah, well, the next adventure, I call the shots. Put it in, partner. Ha! Psych! Oh, yeah. Life is good. So epic and heartwarming and everything. That was Jack 3. That is the you know best thing ever. My one well, of my favorite series of all time. The, this original trilogy was amazing. Jack X was pretty cool. I liked it. It was like Mario Kart, but more intense. Not gonna be doing a let's play of that. Uh, if they do make a new uh, a new Jack game, I'll do a let's play in that, which would be pretty cool. But until then, uh, the Jack series is over. But again, great trilogy of games, Jack and Daxter, like very extremely nostalgic game for me. Like one of the first games I got for the PS2. It's again a great game. Jack 2 was a breath of fresh air. It was great, and this one just closes it all and is just an amazing game. You know, offering you more from offering you more of the Jack and Daxter universe. And giving you more abilities than you could ever wish for from first or second. And still being able to hold the true assets of Jack and Daxter. Um, but again, it's a great game. And also, the game Daxter, I never actually played it. Never seen anything. I saw, I, I think I looked up the ending once. But, um... Yeah, that's that's all I got. Um, but again, Jack 4, it needs to happen. Because again, Jack and Daxter, the Jack series, is a great series. Some of my friends don't like it, and I'm like, how are, are you high? Like, how do you not like it? But people don't like it, I guess. But whatever. That's, that's them. So, not a dog. You should totally get on Jack Four because that would be amazing. I know your guy. You guys are working on Uncharted and everything. And if you ever make a new Last of Us, that'd be kind of cool. <laughs> but anyway, uh, great game. Uh, great series. Um, now like future plans for Let's Plays. Um, I. I talked a little bit about this, and by a little bit, I mean I took a whole half of an episode struggling to even talk about it. Um, it's going to be... Okay, after this, I'm going to finish up slide 2, because that's really close to being done. Episode 8, you know, the whole clockwork shit's going on. Then after that, I'm going to devote all my time, like just regular Let's Play time, on this Let's Play. Just because there is a lot of information to do with it. And a lot of editing that I'm going to be putting into it. And just a lot, just, it's going to be a little bit time consuming. If you catch my drift. And also I'm going to try, this is the one let's play I'm going to be trying to do research on. Uh, for the most part. That's also going to be an extremely long game. I don't want any games to be in between making the let's play even longer than it needs to be. Uh, hints on the Let's Play. Uh, it's on the PS1. It's an RPG, so that eliminates a lot of games. And it was a four-disc set, which was every RPG, so I could have just stuck with that RPG for PS1. But it was a four-disc disc set, and for anybody who really knows me, it's my f favorite RPG, especially out of the series that it is out of. Uh, so that's the next thing coming up after I finish Sly, because again, I don't want any other games being in the way of this Let's Play. Because again, one of my favorite games, and it's, um, one of my favorite, all-time favorite RPGs as well, just in general. Um, so, uh, that's going to be happening after Sly. So, for, for a couple days, there's going to be more Sly. Or I just might do with Sly what I did here and just have sh one recording session straight up because I know I'm at the end. 
Um, but yeah, so uh, that's that. And then it's so it's so weird ending off a let's play. You know, having the credits and you're just like, ah. Oh. Or just in any game, like you play by yourself and you're just like, that was an epic adventure. That was adventure of adventures. And especially when you end off a trilogy like this, where you're like, you know, everything's coming to a close and shit gets real and then that shit is like solved and it's like, god damn. Great game. Great company. I haven't seen anything bad come out of them. Because you have the Crash Bandicoot series that they had to give away because Universal are assholes. Then you have this series, which is absolutely amazing. Then you have the Uncharted series, which is amazingly great. Then you have Last of Us, which is very amazing and one of the best zombie games out there. It's not just a blind shooter like a lot of zombie games are. There are some zombie games that are like strategy based, but n nothing. Wow, nothing, nothing. Uh, nothing close to Last of Us is. It's just, just Naughty Dog in general just makes great games. And then whatever they're gonna be making in the future, like Uncharted 4 and everything, is gonna be great. Or if they start a new IP again, great. That'd be great, and it would probably be great. In every way, shape, or form. They should do a game like this. Like, they have to start making games more like this. Like, there's a lot of games that are ultra-realistic now. Like, Watch Dogs, and GTA, and Uncharted. And by realistic, I mean, like... Yeah, off-the-wall shit does happen, and a lot of the shit will never happen. But it's in more of a realistic setting. Like, like Uncharted takes place in actual parts of the world, and, you know, there's no, sp like, there are some supernatural things with it and whatnot, but again, it's still very, it's humans doing human things, I guess. I, like, the Companies in general have to start making more fantasy, like, games made out of, in, like, fantasy worlds. And having just kind of off the wall or, like, platforming and whatnot. Like, more games like Jack and Daxter or Mario or... Some companies still do, you know, fantasy stuff like there's, um, God of War, Santa Monica. Uh, Infamous is still a good game. And... After credit stuff, I believe. No, it's just new secrets available. Right after the credits, we're here. Um, I guess we could check out the secrets before anything. Um, we did get a dick load of uh, uh, duration for the uh, gyro buster. Uh, vehicle upgrades, we could get... Well, not right now, but we can get vehicles. Crazy stuff, expert options... We can now unlock hero mode, which is playing through the whole game again just with all the upgrades. So, almost the same thing. Uh, unlimited ammo, invulnerability, dark jack, invisibility, always on. Oh, here's the unlimited dark jack and light jack. That takes 50. Fucking A. Uh, scene player act 1, commentary... But yeah, that's the uh, end of this game. Uh, just look and uh, look forward to my next Let's Play after Sly. So, um, if you like this episode or if you like this whole series, thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, subscribe. And until next time, Mega Crage, signing out.